Hi, Jen Dunham here with the Ferris Property Group. Today for home hacks, I'm gonna be making one of these really awesome storage baskets. Um, you can buy these storage baskets at Target, Pier 1, pretty much anywhere where you can buy home goods, but they can also be really pricey. This is one I bought at Target a few years ago, and I think it was $25 just for one basket. These baskets are great to use around your house. They look nice, they're decorative, um, but they're also a great place to put the random stuff that you have lying around. I know I love keeping my kids' toys in them and uh, instead of like lying around the house all over the place. So here's one that I purchased. It looks so pretty, $25. Here is one that I made today in about 25 minutes for under $10 from a bunch of supplies that I bet you have lying around your house or you can purchase really inexpensively from the local store. To get rid of the box pattern and to cover it up with something decorative that you actually would want to display in your house, I'm going to use this decorative rope that I got at Lowe's. Um, what I'm going to do is actually hot glue the rope all the way around the box, creating a nice decorative pattern. Now that my cardboard box has the rope all glued to it, I'm going to add the pillowcase to make it soft inside and give it a pretty decorative edge. Now that I've got my pillowcase cut to the length and the size that I want it to, I'm going to use my glue gun to just fold under the edges and glue it down to the rope. There you have it. Project is all done. I used a total of about four glue sticks. I used a hundred feet of this rope, one box, one pillowcase, needed a pair of scissors and a box cutter. Took me a total of maybe 20 minutes. Super easy project. And now I have this really nice looking storage box. It's gonna really jazz up my house and make it look great. Mm -hmm.